the Hindus of the Punjab are like the biggest victims. And, you know, nobody speaks about it, you know, because this Punjabi spirit is also, you know, move on, forget the past, which has its good side and the bad side. In a good side, you know, you always move on and, you know, we have had so many massacres that we can't count. But the bad side is we repeat it. So nobody studied the partition history. That's what I've, you know, bringing in the beginning of the talk. That's what I was bringing attention to. And 80s was the same thing as 40s. And we didn't study the 80s either. And, you know, we, these Khalistanis are knocking at our door again. So, you know, and even people who write, you know, for example, you know, like in Hudson Report or, you know, Christian Fair, you know, what they say is even KPS Gill, what they show is, for example, I said 22,000 people died. And the way they put it is there were 60,000 Sikhs, uh, uh, sorry, 60% Sikhs and 40% Hindus roughly, right? And 60% deaths were Sikhs and 40% deaths were Hindu. That is one, but the devil is in the detail. If you look at it, 40% of the people who were killed were militants. Right, all the people who picked up the gun were the Sikhs. If you have to count the uh, casualties, you count people in the civilians who didn't pick up the gun. If you pick, if you pick up them, there that eight thousand Hindus died, or what that actually means is, a Hindu civilians was four times as likely to be killed during the terrorism decade than a Sikh. That nobody, I'm telling you, I challenge you, prove me wrong, you will not read it anyway. Now, the second thing is, you know, we talk about exodus from Kashmir. And yes, it happened. I, and I don't know the figures. I'm sorry, I've not studied it carefully. I could also be wrong, but I've usually read figures when I simple search one lakh or three lakh. You know, there was a huge Hindu exodus out of Punjab. So, for example, Punjab population of the time was about 20 million. If you read the census from 1981 to 1991, two and a half percent population of Hindus fall down. That means five lakhs Hindus left. And, you know, but I want to complete it. I don't want to say, if you read from 1981 to 1991, that two and a half percent actually came back as well. So most of the Hindus also came back because Hindu Sikhs had no problem. Mm -hmm. But the Sakalis and terrorism had created such a situation. Now, you know, for example, this Tavleen Singh, I have a lot of respect for her because, you know, she was a Sikh and she bravely covered and we keep posting on this. You would not believe that they had basically, what they said in Ralif Chalif Ghali in Kashmir, that either you convert or, you know, you leave or we will kill you. I can show you Tavleen Singh reportage saying the exact same thing. That Hindus, you leave, otherwise they will not leave your women and children alive. This is what they, they are burning pregnant women alive. This is India. They, they posted a poster like Samaj Sudhar in 1987. And that said, anybody who goes to Jagrata or goes to Radha Swami or, you know, does this, we will burn them alive. And this is not an empty boast. They actually killed people like that. Whoever says Jan Gan Man will kill them alive. You know, they say if you, uh, everybody has to wear a Talibani uniform like a saffron turban and, you know, white shirt and black pants. Won't do it. Will burn. Actually, there is a report by Shekhar Gupta. Reportage. You read, you know, they are saying uh, that they went and, you know, the poor primary teacher said, we have the children of laborers. You know, we don't have an extra uniform that you're saying, you know, you are on my bath, you know, like, of course, you can kill us. Please give us a few days. These are children of laborers. We don't have an extra. They killed the primary teacher. What was happening in Punjab was such a, uh, what do you say, traumatic event that people don't want to remember. But this just happened a generation ago. How, for example, Khalistanis indulged in like mass rapes of women. And that's how actually they lost. So we put all this data here that nobody actually wants to do. And it's not... So what I'm saying is or some Khalistani canard or something like that. It's based on extensive reportage and this reportage was done by the same like New York Times or LA Times as well. But you know, people have just forgotten what happened in the 1980s. Please remember to subscribe to us and switch on the notifications for this channel. For our other social media links, more content and to support our work, please visit citti.net. Dhanavad. Namaskar.